Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. Today we are going to learn deploy the Node.js application on AWS EC2 instance. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So first of all, log into your AWS account. Here you need to go with the services and type EC2. Let's go to that part. Okay, after this, you have to go with the launch instance. Let's go to launch the instance. So here I need to just type the Node.js, my application. Here I will select the Ubuntu because uh, I normally I work on the Ubuntu, right? So this is by default it is selected. If you want to change, you can change it accordingly. Okay. Next, we have to generate the key pair login. If you don't have, then please generate the key pair. So here you can see that you can create the key pair enter the name of that one rsa uh, if you are in the windows then use the ppk if you're on the linux dot go with the pem file right and then click on the create key pair okay i already created so i'm going to select it right so here we have the network so here the ppc is not created so make sure you have to create the vpc then come to that one so you automatically adjust it okay so this is how allow the http from the internet this this you can check up, depends upon to you right Next, we have to configure that uh, this is the basic requirement. Okay, after that, we have to go with the launch instance. Okay, so it will help you to creating the launching the in instance. Okay, so this is done. Okay, let's go to the instances. So here you can see that the instance is launching and instance states is pending. Okay, so let's uh, connect to the terminal and then install the Node.js Git so that we can clone the repo and just try to push the code over the instance okay let's have a look so currently it's on the pending state so here we are just once it's uh, in success mode then we will try to connect here you can see that the connect part is not coming right now so basically it's a pending state so first we will check out with the code so here i'm going to use any of the repo you can see the for the node.js application what they have written down in the index so it's basically they have mentioned the server port is running and this one. Okay, that's simple code that we can use. Okay, is it done? So it's currently in the pending state. Just wait, I think uh, one or two more minutes. Then let me pause the video. Then when it's completed, then we will move forward. Just give me a second. Then I have to pause this video right now. Okay. So do the. Now here you can see that the instance is running. Okay. So let's try to connect the instance. So here I'm going to go with the connection. Connect using the EC2 instance. Okay. So Ubuntu. Let's try to connect with this one. So it will give me the console of that one. Okay. Let's try to install the Git first. So here we going with the install the Git. Okay, so let's L S and PWD, which directory we are home Ubuntu. So first install the oh sorry, this is Control Shift V. So let's install the Git first. Git is already in the newest version, and let's check the Node version. Node is not installed, so Node hyphen V. So currently Node version is not uh, Node cannot be found, but we can install with this. Just copy this and paste this over here sudo app install node.js so what it says okay, let's install the node so here we have the command okay so let's paste this moving to the next then let's go to this one okay let's go and install node okay so node hyphen v let's have a check on that so it's node 20 so node version is install git is installed let's try to go with git clone so here the package this i'm going to use the code from the github repository so you can do any this one git clone with this one sorry again control shift v i do okay enter so this is done if you go with the ls you can see that if you go with the cd node hello and we will go with npm install with the packages okay this is done 
now the next command is uh, node the name uh, let's do the ls and uh, here we have the index.js so we'll go with the node index.js file so the server is running let's go and check the instance over here we have to go with the inbound rules also so you see to dashboard so in instance is running like this one okay let's try to this and here we have the inbound rules let me hide this first okay so here we have the rules so where we have the rules networking subnet open IP address let's have a look unable to connect okay so we have to go with the rules we have to add security groups and uh, there we have the security groups let's go and edit this inbound rules okay so here we have this one add a new rule so i'm going with custom tcp and the port should be i need to define that should be here anywhere we will add with and here we will go with the port i think which port it is i need to check which port they have running i think 3000 right so let's enable the 3000 port from here so 3000 port okay let's go and just save this rule this is done let's try to reload on the port number basically http not the https and we will go with 3000 port right so here we go with that hello node the, is set up perfectly now i want to make it running uh, with the help of the pm2 let's install the pm2 also on the same node so here we will go with the pm2 so that whenever the terminal is closed it automatically runs right so go to the instance and uh, let's control c and just add the pm2 globally okay and let's run the server and here we have the index.js right so we will add the index.js my node app with the help you can start the application like this okay once it's installed and done <coughs> okay let's paste this and here we go with this one app is running so when i go and just click on this one whenever i disconnect this uh, terminal also it automatically runs right here you can see that okay so this is how the node.js deployment part is done any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day so